This thing working? What's going on guys, Andrew here from Autosports Engineering. Today we are going to be doing an install on our one piece smart bracket for the 2J GE and GTE motors. Let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to attach the two provided spacers that come with this bracket as well as the bottom bracket for your GE. Now this bracket in particular is going to take the two smallest Allen, Allen bolts that are provided. We're going to screw those into the Allen bolts here and we're going to go ahead and match it here. Next we are going to take our two provided six mils that come with your kit and those with along with the lock washers and then we're going to install them here on the back two bolts. Now we can take our Denso coil pack along with our medium sized hardware and proceed with the install. When you're doing your install, be sure to remove the O-ring so that it sits flush on this bracket in particular. So And there you have it guys, here's the install on the one piece smart bracket for the 2J GE motor. As you can see, it's bolted down firm. Each coil pack is bolted down as well, firmly, not moving anywhere. Now it is a little bit different for the 2J GTE version. Let's go check it out. Now here we are with a 2J GTE motor the back bracket that is supplied with your one piece bracket will be removed and the points of contacts will now be the two washers, the spacers here, and the extended six millimeter bolts that come with your kit. Now you may have a super tight fitment, but that is only because we want to ensure that the bracket does not move while the vehicle is running or have any issues going down the track. So go ahead and tighten those bolts up. Now we can repeat the same process as we did for the GE. Do not forget to remove your O-rings on your Denzel coil packs. And that's gonna be the basic quick install for our Autosports Engineering One Piece Smart Coil Bracket. Now, as I stated before, this coil bracket does work with the GE and GTE, as well as the 1J GTE. Same configuration, we're gonna remove the back bracket as we did on the 2J GTE. If you guys have any more questions about this product and more, send us an email to autosportsengineering at gmail.com. Till next time.